Hello and welcome everybody, it's an Epic Play Name, and today we're going to take a look at another Fallout 4 mod. This time on the table is, funnily enough, Convenience Stores, which kind of has to be put on the table. Yeah, you get me. Anyway, back on topic. This mod lets you place two items in game, once a cash register and then a med kit, which stands as a replacement for in game shops that Bethesda has given us the default ones, the five ugly ones, like that, and that, and that, and that, and that. Doesn't exist anymore. You don't need them. You can now place the in game items that the mod gives us. So, we're going to take a quick look at the how you can do that. And here we are in game, in front of our trusty gun weapons and supply shop, which I've set up for this demonstration purpose. As you can see in the background, I'm also using the mod, which lets you place walls, uh, items on the walls, because it just looks amazing. Now, this is the immersion we're looking for. Anyway, what you want to do is you go into your workshop menu or your crafting menu, however we're going to call it, go to the stores items tab, right? You scroll over here to the stores tab, go into that and then you can see that we have our categories for everything. What we want to choose is weapons because obviously this is a weapon store. Now you can already see there is two new items, actually three new items. It's kind of the same item, but it's different categories. Um, we're just going to place this one here, which is like a tier one trader. So I'm going to try to put that on the shelf there. So there we go. Okay, right there. And this now is equals to a simple player shop, which means you can just click on any settler with the E command and then assign them to the new resource once it's actually in view. So there we go. There you go. Now he's he's assigned to that position. He probably needs a couple of moments to actually realize what he's uh, supposed to do. And afterwards, he will be taking this quite seriously and sell his weapons. So uh, let's try that quickly. Yep. And there you go. You have the bottom menu, which means he can sell his weapons and there is all the goodies. So that's how you set up a shop. Now, it is actually quite simple. Um, there is a little bit of something to it. It has like a default height that it puts it to. Now, you can currently fix this with either a separate mod or with in-game commands, which you can already see on my console. Just click the element and then you will enter mod pass. Then you type either X, Y or Z axis, depending on which direction you want to move it. In my case, since it's a little bit too high, I'm just going to type the Z axis and then type minus five. That should be enough. That's the amount of sort of like height measurement that you want to move it. This minus uh, is going downwards and therefore it'll kind of like sink into uh, the shelf right here. It's a little bit too, too, yeah, too, too low there, but that doesn't matter. It looks actually quite good. Yeah, uh, cool mod. Please endorse it. Give the author thanks, thumbs up, and I hope you enjoyed this mod review.